guys, it's Alana. So today I filmed this quick little hair tutorial. It is two braids. I've been wearing my hair like this lately, so I figured I would show you guys how to do it. Um, two braids attached at the end with just a rubber band, and then I curled after to save some time. Um, I'm constantly looking for some new hairstyles, so I decided that maybe I would just share this with you. So stay tuned with it. What I really need is that. This is my natural frizzy hair. It's all right, guys. I totally embrace it. First, what you want to do is part your hair to the side. You want to separate the front part of your hair so we can start braiding. Take the portion to the top is where we're going to start the Dutch braid. To do the Dutch braid, you start braiding from underneath. To be doing the specific braid that I did, I'm only going to be pulling and adding hair from the front half of my head. And the reason why I'm only pulling from the front is because the braid stands out a lot more that way. When you get to about where your ear is at, that's when you want to stop pulling hair and just braid all the way down. Using a rubber band, secure the braid into place. Then you want to do the same exact braid to the other side of your head. Now that you have two braids, you're going to wrap them around your head and attach them together with a rubber band. Okay, so this side is curled. This side is not curled. You see? And I curl my hair after I already do the hairstyle because typically I'm always in a hurry. I'm trying to save time somewhere, so I only want to curl the stuff that I need. This is like prob this and this equal probably about a fourth of the hair that I have, so then it saves me time from curling that since I'm gonna braid it anyway, so. You wanna wrap it around and curl it going backwards. Wrap your hair going towards the back of you. I normally pull it because I don't like my hair too curly. I just want like a soft wave, so I'll pull it to stretch the curls out. I'm just gonna repeat that for the rest of the hair that I have left, and then I will be right back. Okay, my hair is really long, so I'm gonna have to back up. But I finished curling the end and I'm just gonna pull it apart. Like I said, I don't like my hair to look super curly. I just like it to look like a soft wave. So I'm just gonna brush it out with my fingers. And the last part I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start pulling on my braid to make my braid fatter, more visible. Yeah. And we're done. 